This is a fan-based parody. Star Wars is owned by Disney. Please support the official release. Last time on Weekend Star Warriors, a lot of shit happened. <laughs> we walk over to the tour. Full of confidence in our new outfits. Yeah, we strut over to we the strut. tour. We strut and make that bitch our runway. I'm coming up to Shogo and asking him, what do you see right now? They seem to have snuck away from the group. Okay. I'm trying to sense them. Liliana seems confident, but the other two seem quite nervous, as if they've messed up with something. We're so bad at this! <laughs> so we Nothing. sneak in, no one knows anything. Funny, we know how to blend in. I suppose it does say something that the giant Wookiee managed to blend in better than we did. Anyway. Yeah. As you turn the corner of the landing, mm -hmm. there is a pair of Theed Royal Security Guards. Oh boy. Oh, hello! I am the great Princess Jupiter. <laughs> Another group of tourists. Come on, we'll take you to the bathroom. Oh, thank you oh, thank so you. much. I so appreciate it. Come back to the tour. McClaw and Shogo look at you. Hi. Hello. hello. Shut up. You had one job. <laughs> one job. And here we are. Don't glare at us. Um, glare at Princess Jupiter. <laughs> I'm going to go into the bathroom, come out as an Inquisitor. As you pass each other... Oh, we're with him. <laughs> she means the royal we. Told you I was royalty. Why don't you believe me? Okay. <laughs> the three of you stay with the group you while Shogo and Liliana move up. You suddenly hear a voice, very authoritative. What do you think you're doing? <laughs> now, Queen Kylanthia, I need to discuss with you about your security arrangements. Might we retire to your throne room? You managed to find that the Emperor is scheduled to visit Theed Palace the very next day. <laughs> so security will be very greatly increased here. Oh, we should get out of here. I'm gonna call him like, Guys, the Emperor's gonna be here tomorrow. We gotta get off this planet, like, ASAP. <laughs> or or we're not going to kill the emperor. Okay. Uh could all of you please come to the third floor? I think I've made a deal with the queen. So do you wait to go in or do you or no, do you wait I, for everyone I else? I go right in. You see Queen Kylanthia with a holdout blaster pressed right to Shogo's head. Oh. Oh. Hell. Welcome to Weekend Star Warriors. Yes, that's our name. Can we go to Naboo? I've been trying to get to Naboo for months. Ever since I've met her, she's been talking about getting to Naboo. Mm. I want to go to Naboo. It, yeah, she's mentioned it at least four times. I'm pretty sure I've heard of it. Yeah. I'm good at everything. Why do I sound like like a bird who's dying? No offense, but you don't look like the most peaceful individual. I took this time to violently cut out his eye. And here it is. I am sufficiently intimidated. My knowledge of Jedi and the Force starts and ends with, there were Jedi, they were cool, now they're gone. I'm trying to find out what's wrong with this lightsaber. <laughs> There's nothing wrong with it. Is a, it is a yeah, it's in your possession. How did it get to you? So much for professional warriors. <laughs> and you have a couple turns before the rest of them arrive. Oh, yeah, arrive. we don't know this yet. She's no. in first. Oh, right. We're, we're heading I aim my E-11 blaster at her. Uh, hold on, hold on. She's not going to hurt me, I think. She's just very... Very suspicious. Suspicious. So she needs a gun to your head because she's suspicious? The last time a Zabrak came to our castle, a Jedi died. Ah. Plus, this particular Zabrak I know is supposed to be already dead. Wait, 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 so you're with the Jedi? You support the Jedi? There are no Jedi left. I'm training to be a Jedi. Her gun District. falters for a moment. There are more with you, is that correct? Yes. Perhaps we should have this conversation when they get here. All right. You wait a couple minutes, the door is open, and hey, you guys these don't three come in. You not think we're into a trap, do you? Ah, uh, um, crap. Shoot. No, don't, no, don't shoot. say that. I mean, do not say that. Criff, criff, criff is what I meant. Criff. 
What up, bitches? Nice club in the house. <laughs> Fly like paper, get fine like Fucking what time you guys stay quiet? <laughs> I just said that. <laughs> <laughs> the one time you get into it, like, we, our teammate has like, a gun aimed at his head. Shut up. Time's done. I guess over. Now we know what you're Moment's doing. over. Anyway. <laughs> so, <laughs> yeah, she no. has already talked to me. Perhaps one oh, of good. you could explain why I shouldn't blast this Imperial Inquisitor's brains out. Because he owes me a life debt. You can talk? <laughs> I can talk. I can walk. I can sing. <laughs> she can sing. <laughs> that can talk, too. I'm not a that. I'm a she. Thank you. She's a woman. Mm-hmm. Her name's Pink. A very woman. <laughs> That's right. Walking down the street. Fuzzy, fuzzy. <laughs> Can I'd like to meet? Look, lady, if you are on the side of the Jedi, then I think we're all on the same side. Pull up. Why, why do you sound like you just had a few drinks? That's a great question. <laughs> <laughs> she's ner- she's I'm nervous. I'm very nervous. <laughs> all right, so you're on the side of the Jedi? I am on the side of my people. Which are on the side of the Jedi. The last monarch who sided with the Jedi got her entire court executed in front of her. So you're like on the down low on the side of the Jedi. Right, like why are you trying to shoot this um, this Inquisitor? Because obviously you think he's still an Inquisitor. If you were Imperial, you wouldn't shoot him, right? He's actually, he's under his life debt and he's training us to be Jedi. I, no, we may not look it. I think I look it. <laughs> oh, that's quite ironic. A man trained to kill Jedi, serving to bring them back. It's sort of helpful for us. Yes. Bit of insider information, mm. you know? I shot him in the head. He'll tell you that. <laughs> she she did. did not side yeah. with him before. She did. See this missing horn? That was her. Well, I felt we had... like you did, so I completely get it. I do. I, I didn't trust him at first either, but... Yeah, but he's... Still doing it, for being honest. But... <laughs> yeah, not completely. We're getting there. Hmm. <laughs> you tried trusting I may us. have been really drunk and... And? What happened after you were, you were really drunk, Liliana? <laughs> the whole court question. wants to know. Tell yeah. us. Not just you. You see. No, I want to know too. Hmm. Try to seduce him. Oh my god! <laughs> Did I didn't think you were actually serious. I, I thought you were doing drunk. a bit. I had tried. Does that mean he, I was drunk? Does that mean you failed? Yes. Guys, you're what making you us thinking? not look good. We're supposed <laughs> oh, to be Jedi's in training. Oh right, um, that's I totally what we are. And I pull useless. out my lightsaber, not threateningly, just demonstrate, straight, straight away. demonstrably. Okay, straight away. The good kind of Jedi who don't get counsels Shh, killed. She's trying to talk. Sorry. She looked really mad. What do you say, Queenie? No. Oh, you have put me in a difficult position. Sorry. I wish the best for my people, so I am trying to stay in charge so that the Emperor doesn't kill me and replace me with one of his puppet governors. Sure. He thinks I am his puppet because I replaced the last queen who protected a Jedi. So, there may be a way out of this. Hmm. Are we listening? I- You see, sometimes the best laid plans can fall apart when a monkey wrench is thrown in. Sure. We're all monkey wrenches. That is quite obvious from your behavior. (laughs) Didn't ask for a judgment call, but okay. Right. Reading glasses on, I guess. (laughs) Look, I'm trying to protect my people. The Emperor catches a single whiff of compliance with anyone other than him. He won't hesitate to execute half the population. <gasps> Idea. Me. Yeah. I don't know if it's a good one, but everyone thinks you're dead, right? Not the queen, the... Shogo. Shogo. Yes. What if, and I point to the queen, it's like, you say you captured us and killed us. That way you have a show of strength. We don't have to worry about being hunted anymore because everyone assumes we're dead. And everybody's That's a great idea. 
But would, please don't actually kill us because that'd be bad. I'm wanted by the Empire. That's true. And that she's wanted alive. She's, I've wanted, You're wanted, I'm wanted alive specifically. Wanted alive. Yes. But mm. if the if the rest of us were killed, yeah, I don't think Mom would appreciate her being. There. I don't no. know. Like I don't know if her mom set the bounty or whatever. If the rest of us were mm-hmm. killed, that's. A I good think idea. she did, and she said it for me being alive. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Take off your sunglasses. You're Liliana Emerald. Yes. And you are on the side of the Jedi. Yes, that's where I found myself. She puts down her gun. I feel I can trust you. Oh, good. And Shogo (laughs) continues to stand there. May I leave now? A little shook up, are you? <laughs> I've been shot in the head once. I don't like the feeling. Lord, no. I wish not to provoke anyone. Glad to hear it. Uh-huh. <laughs> You're the pet that was worth ten credits. <laughs> <I'm> not... <laughs> yes, she is that. She is only that and nothing else. Here's the problem. The entire planet has been locked down. Apparently, Miss Emerald... Your comments of needing to go to Naboo reached higher ears. And now everyone knows that you came here. Oh, Oh, that's wonderful. This is literally face palms. (laughs) But we were sightseeing while we had half the galaxy chasing after us. And while I appreciate your love of my planet... Her. Chasing her, not us. Not me. They think I'm a well, pet. maybe McClaw because they think he captured but me. But they don't know I was with her. They might now. Oh well, yeah. They also wanted you for tax evasion. Why <laughs> again? It's the corporate sector. It is what they do. Yeah, that's a good point. <laughs> <fan. laughs> you know how much my debt is? Because I honestly don't. I think it's a little more than twenty. Thousand. <laughs> oh, yeah. Probably. I've never had that I much money have. in my life. <laughs> well. If only there was a way we could sneak you out under the cover of a large distraction. One that could not be linked to me. I slowly turn And the sneaking out could not be linked to you. I slowly turn to look at McClaw. Big distractions are one of his specialties. What do you have in mind? Well, the Alliance attempted an attack on the Emperor's retreat several months ago. They were massacred. And then the Imperial forces massacred a nearby town, as an example. So, if a third party, not an established party, not the Alliance, not myself, some unknown person, were to cause an accident, possibly even make it look like it was the folly of the Imperial forces themselves, then that might take some of the heat off of my people. The Emperor's wrath would be directed inwards, rather than towards me or my people. All right. Well, how do we pin something bad on the Empire without actually hurting anybody? I've been or lo- hurting some of the Empires. Yeah, I don't mind hurting the Empire. It's <laughs> fair. I've been looking into it. After the incident with the Death Star, <laughs> the Emperor ordered an extensive energy shielding and turbo laser emplacements to be installed on the entire cliffside of the retreat. What I really want is that retreat off my planet. Mm -hmm. Without it there, the Alliance will no longer try to attack and no longer incite retaliatory action from the Emperor. Mm -hmm. How big of a party are we talking here as far as getting into that palace? Or into that retreat, I mean. That will be a little difficult, but I will leave that part up to you. Are we looking as far as, like... A big group, or are we looking as an infiltration group? I believe you five should be sufficient. All right. Though, do not try this Inquisitor trick again. <laughs> if I know that he's dead, the rest of them will know it. Fair enough. I have a very simple idea. You see, the initial architect figured the steep cliffside would be too sheer for anyone to try and climb. Mm-hmm. However, now there are several turbo laser emplacements mm-hmm. along the cliffside. Mm-hmm. Yet, for some reason, they use the same turbo lasers that are used on star destroyers. Cheap. Not cheap, but 
they rotate 360 degrees. Sure. So... Just point them in what? Exactly. If we point them back towards the cliff side and program all of them to fire non-stop, <laughs> it would destroy the entire cliff side and cause and the entire happened. retreat to fall into the sea. And could look like an accident. Yeah. Exactly. I think that's a great idea. I have had I several months it. to think about this, but there was no way I could implement it. Sure. Until I found Us. a particular monkey wrench. Aww, <laughs> oh, we're a particular monkey wrench. It should be our in our t-shirts. It should be. <laughs> <laughs> See, the three of us have a contest going every day. How many times can we each make McClaw face palm? Yeah. The, the end of the day, we tally them up. And, and see let, how big the bruise is on his face. Big <laughs> surprise afterwards for me. <laughs> a hug. Yeah. <laughs> I would Where be surprised. I crush the living breath out of that. Uh, he's all talk. His bark it. is worse than his bite. Okay. I've never been punched. Okay. Come on, punch me. I'm too cute. <laughs> well, I'm not going to punch you. I know. He's going to crush you. No. I've no. seen him. Don't do believe many. it. Don't I've believe seen it. him smash heads. So, <laughs> I can sneak you out of the city. <laughs> Such a good demonstration of our unity. You know? <laughs> I can sneak you out of the city. Right? Mm -hmm. However, to get into the Emperor's retreat, you may need some kind of distraction from someone other than myself. Hmm. <gasps> What about? What, I don't we, want to hear it. I okay. don't want to know we might anything. Have some ideas. I just want you to destroy that retreat and make it look like an accident. And really, we have to do it before uh, he arrives tomorrow. The uh, emperor. He's arriving tomorrow. Oh, that thing! It's always faked. Huh? What? They always say that the emperor is arriving tomorrow in the computers just to keep everyone. Uh -oh. Busy. You know, the Emperor's coming, look busy. But but is it ever true? Sometimes, though he rarely visits the palace, he'd be more likely to be at his retreat. That's what I'm saying. We right. Got... Can we catch him in the crossfire? Mm. You want to take on Emperor I'm Palpatine take himself? On the Emperor. Not right directly, on. I'm just saying but we I stage like... the explosion so that it happens when he's there but and the it takes him out that way. be so much higher when he's there. I think we should do it beforehand. Oh, and while killing the Emperor is a good idea, I'm pretty sure that's not going to happen for a little while. I will yet. leave it to you. Though. I will have my people escort you out <laughs> of the secret passage behind the waterfall. And we won't talk about our plan while they're doing it, so all of you have plausible deniability. Yeah? Yes. Yeah. Good. Shh. What? Yeah. Can I have a question. Hmm? Yes? What plan? Are there any maps of the facility? She gives you a basic sketch. It's considered high treason to have any real map of the facility. Okay. But that is it. Do I have anything to use to trace over it or, like, kind of get my... So I have my own copy to carry around and look at? Mm -hmm. She gives you the paper. All right. It's best if that's never seen again. Very well. At least in my palace. All right. I'll eat it later. Mm -hmm. So they escort you out. You retrieve your speeder bikes, and where do you go? Where should we go? I have to figure out how we're gonna make this. Go to a cantina so we can actually start talking about. Let's just say that you go to a cantina at a place further away than yeah. Bede. Yeah, here is a map of Naboo. Because apparently we discussed our plans too loud, and now people followed us to Naboo. Yeah, about that. I'm cutting you guys off from the spice. Okay, let's say that you go to uh, Karen. Yeah, let's just, just find a nice place to hunker down for a while and figure out what we're going to do. So, we've got to get into a facility, turn a cliffside gun on itself, and then not be there when things go south. Basically? Uh, do I have that right? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Let's just say that we aren't in Karen, because you just blurted out... No, I was, I was trying to say it quietly, but I'll... <laughs> Why don't we just go back We're to camping the in the outskirts, I'd say. Okay. We've made a campfire and are sure. sitting around it. Right. <laughs> you guys want to go back to my ship so I can pick up some grenades? We're not allowed to... <laughs> Dang it, never mind. <laughs> yeah, I wanted to do that too, like because we can talk in your ship, but they've taken it from us, right? No, it's an no, order. It's an oh, it's... We just... It's, it's right. been locked your, down. Your friend's mm -hmm. keeping it afloat. Okay. 
Yeah, we find a nice spot away from prying ears and we start discussing over the campfire. What is the plan? Well, you, Shogo, you're the one who knows the most about the layout of the retreat, yes? Yes, yes I do. Where's a good place for us to start? Hmm. I hate to say it, mm -hmm. but the best plan is similar to the plan we used with Theed. We may want to pretend to be tourists again. <laughs> Because right. that worked out so well last time. Can we visit the... The Emperor has established Empire Land right outside. Yeah. Empire Land? What? Yes. What is Empire Land? You Other look guys. deeply ashamed of this, Shogun. I, I am. What is Empire Land? Please tell us. It's an amusement park <laughs> set out front of the Emperor's retreat. Oh yeah, I want to go to that. What does an Empire amusement park even look like? We're about to find out. There are Ferris wheels with the Imperial crest on no, them. No, there's not. You're lying to me. No. <laughs> there are simulators of various TIE fighters that people can play in. Fun. That actually sounds fun. That yeah. does sound fun. Are there any uh, roller coasters? Can you shoot down like the rebel scum? Yes. yes really? I was kidding. And there are roller coasters. One that tracks the entire Kessel Run. Not exactly to scale, but similar. Sure. Of course. Legendary. <laughs> Legend. Airy. <laughs> mm. <laughs> but the thing is, no one really ever goes. Most of the people who go are forced to do so. Well, we're going to go and actually have fun. <laughs> you guys are great at looking reluctant. That's true. <laughs> That's true. If anything, the acting will have to be us acting like we're not enjoying the heck out of this theme. I right hope now. you play the best role while you're here. <laughs> what role is that? Being so miserable. <laughs> it's gonna okay. be a you, ex <laughs> you excel at finding ways to keep me that way. So I'm sure we can work together. <laughs> but... I think it might be worthwhile to try and draw off their forces from the main group. Because, mm. I mean, Liliana went over the uh, how much they have. Hundreds of TIE fighters, hundreds of scout walkers. So you're saying uh, send in the tourists to provide a distraction while the real work goes on on the other side. No, I'm saying put the tourists, us, in place have someone else create a distraction so that most of the forces go to another place mm -hmm. and then sneak in somewhere else. Mm. So I we would really have to like have a grenade to... right now to pretend like we did a terrorist attack on the <laughs> theme park. That would attract attention. What, going to the theme park? No, just <laughs> throwing a grenade a, in the Throwing a the grenade oh, in the yeah, theme park. Yeah, a little bit. I think we want to, well, it is the Empire. I was about to say we, we might want to minimize casualties, but f*** it, it's the Empire. Who cares? And obviously the people going to this theme park don't actually want to be there. Hmm. I'm sure some of them must be having fun. I'm picturing, like, that red Imperial Guard thing, like, sitting on a roller coaster super stoically as it moves up and down. It's <laughs> mm, still in mm, uniform. Mm, mm, <laughs> like, a, like those clown things that you punch just rocking back and forth. <laughs> they do have several people wearing high-ranking Stormtrooper armor for pictures. <laughs> you can take pictures with the Stormtroopers? Yes, they have people pretending to be Inquisitors as well. That's so weird. <laughs> okay, wait, hang on. We can use this oh yeah you could pretend to be one of the um... uh, one of the pretend inquisitors yes and then you can sneak in, sneak off to where the other pretend inquisitors are and cause some sort of distraction <sighs> yes we're throwing you into danger again <laughs> get used to it okay or do we have access to like uh, stormtrooper armor and then that way he couldn't be recognized well, there's a difference between going to Empire Land and going to the Emperor's Retreat. There's huge security between here and there. Sure. Can you, if you, oh no, wait, I think you're dead. Can you turn up and be like, hey, I'm not dead. Also, I found these people. Help Probably me. Probably not. No. Okay. Vader stabbed me through the chest. That's fair. You were there. <laughs> I was. Yeah, and the, she told me specifically, asked us specifically not to to use that trick. Yeah. Yes. Because it didn't work on her, so it's not going to work on them. Right. That's it. <sighs> hmm. I think our distraction, and I know it may be mean to say this, I think our best distraction lies in asking the Gungans to Hell attack somewhere else. The same thing. 
attack somewhere else. I yes. almost feel like going to get her boy. I mean, it technically, is. we did go in and get information for them, and technically that True. information says that the Emperor is going to be at Theed, so it would make sense for the Gungans to attack if they had that information. That is true. That is a good plan. Um, my question is, is there a way that we could keep that cover? What sort of um, blasts do these guns they've attached to the cliff give? Are they plasma? No, they're regular blasts. Is there a way to get them to help without exposing them? Probably getting the shamed one. I agree. I think the shamed one might want to come with us just in case the emperor is in his retreat. All right. And regardless, he is quite well versed in fighting. I watched him and he seems to have mastered beyond all seven forms of lightsaber combat. Really? All right. Well, all right. That sounds like a great boost to our team. Yeah, for sure. Let's do it. I'd suggest we don't take him with us to the land. Yeah, that makes to sense. Empire Land yeah. though. No. Maybe post him somewhere in a lake nearby yeah. so he can join us as we're sneaking in. Sure. Yes. But uh, we will I'll have be to be with him. Okay. But we will have to return and uh, talk to the Gungans and tell them what we've found. Yes. Well, in a time like the present. Thanks for listening to Weekend Star Warriors. I am your host and game master, John Ike. Star Wars was created by George Lucas and is owned by Disney. This game follows the basic rules of the Edge of the Empire role-playing game, and rule books are available for sale wherever books are still sold. Liliana Emerald was played by Megan Cordero. You can follow her on Instagram at Meganda88. Zizix Math was played by Jeffrey Gardner. You can follow him on Instagram at Jeffa Plus. Ping Pong was played by Kat Johnston. You can follow her on Instagram at BirdieCat82. McClaw was played by Edgar Cuevas. You can try to follow him, but do so at your own risk. Music by Megan Cordero. Sound effects from soundboard.com. Special thanks to Mike Christensen and Nadisa Cuevas. Please like, subscribe, and review, and we will release the next episode in a couple of weeks. Thanks for listening, and remember... Empire Land. Yeah. Empire Land? What? You All look deeply as ashamed of this, Sean. I, I am. I would like to point out if no. people, who knew... <laughs> hush. Did, any, did no. anyone know, besides us know you were going to Naboo? No. Well, See, told you. Just making sure <laughs> nobody knew about Naboo. <laughs> and your gun jams. Ah, I sit down with you two for two seconds, and now I'm involved. I just want to point that out. Okay, <laughs> what's the plan here? Landing PP. I'm not sure this is sanctioned by the Rebel Alliance, so uh, do it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Pretty much all. <laughs> <laughs> All of this guy's blood is now on the ground. As Ewoks, we are beings of honor. Now, who do you want to designate for corpse duty? Oh. Can we loot them? Bacon! We're gonna go. We can leave. Let's leave. <laughs>